Oh, I just hit my knee against the radiator. Good morning. Happy Monday, everyone. How's it going? Uh, I hope everyone's all right. God, uh, I feel strange this morning. I'm a bit, I feel very strange this morning. I think I, I um, had quite a lot to eat last night. We had, a, we had a little barbecue for my nan. So I ate a lot of food, a lot of food. I had some of it for my breakfast as well. Guess I'm not going hungry for like five, five weeks. A lot of food. Fans making weird noises. I don't like it. So I'm just gonna, gonna turn it back and ignore it. But good morning everyone. Hello, how's it going? It's Monday again. Oh crap. It's Monday again. Welcome back to the daily vlog. Yeah, I had a pretty, pretty sick weekend. Um, sorry, on Saturday I watched quite a lot of films. I watched three films in one day. What's um, pretty good going? Um, I knew I couldn't watch a film on Sunday, so I started to try and get all over and done with um, on Saturday. Upgrade first, then I watched My Brother Where Art Thou, and then I watched uh, Perks of Being a Wallflower. All three were pretty solid films. Yeah, I, I enjoyed. I enjoyed. Yeah, I enjoyed them. I can see um, the hype of Perks of Being a Wallflower. I could definitely see the hype of it. See why people really, really like it and how it means a lot to different people. And then Oh Brother, we're out there. The Coen Brothers film. I've been on kind of a Coen Brothers kind of run recently. I did a uh, Burn After Reading last week. Upgrade was a great little kind of it was indie film. I definitely recommend checking it out if you're. A fan of like action and films like Ex Machina, you might really like it. It's kind of set in this dystopian future. The world building's brilliant. Uh, the effects are great. And uh, the performances are pretty, pretty good. So I would definitely recommend watching um, Upgrade. Oh. Oh. So it's a long morning. I have quite a long week this week. Um, it's my week before I go away to Germany. I'm going to Berlin next week. I could have a package come today, so I'm going to come today or tomorrow. If you watch last week's vlog, then you know what's coming. Not surprised. I can't wait for that to come, because that'll be sick. I'm really looking forward to that. I got a lot of work to do today, especially that it's like still kind of my, my nan's birthday celebrations. We're going out for a meal tonight. As soon as Berlin's out of the way, I have to really start preparing for university. A hard adjustment to make. Never lived alone. I don't think many people have at the age of 18. I think at least I am not the only one in my boat, if that phrase is that phrase. At least I'm not the only one in this situation a bit scared to, to move in. But hopefully it's going to be alright. Hopefully, um, I don't know what university means for the vlog. I don't know what it means for everything else, but I'm going to. But I'll see what, what happens. Um, it, it might change. It might, might take different forms, but I think I'm just going to continue doing. But I, don't, I haven't really decided yet. From what I'm looking at it now is that... I kind of want to do it as if it's like the vlog is continuous. Maybe I don't do it every day. I don't. I don't really know what it means at the moment. If you know what I mean. Because I'd love to keep the series going. That's basically it. I'd love to keep the series going. Uh, but I don't know what form it would take and how I'll do it. So I'm just gonna have to decide and see what I feel. Oh, I'm a tired boy. I'm tired of making montage shorts. I want to make something good. I want to make something that's serious. It's actually a short film. You've seen like my, my short films where it's like usually like a boy is sad and then he looks up and there's something, some kind of special effect and he's unhappy or there's some kind of monologue involved and it's just like two minutes. Micro shorts. They're called micro shorts. It's a short film that's under three minutes or a short film under five minutes depending on where you're from or the what festival you're submitting to. They're called micro shorts and they're great. Micro shorts are great. They're a great uh, way to make stuff. Great way to make stuff. Um, and it's a great way to do stuff. I've watched about a thousand micro shorts in um, like in quarantine and uh, I've made I've made quite a few of my own and I like making them. They're very fun. But I, I kind of just wanted, I wanted to feel like, I don't know, I feel like I'm kind of doing the same thing and I always want to do something else. I want to do something a bit bigger, challenge myself a bit more, see what I can make. I'm going to, I'm going to see if I can make something. I have a story. I do have a story. I just need to apply it to a character and then I have a short film. And then I'm going to try and write as much as I can today, sketch as much as I can today. I can make it and it'll be like a last, it could be almost a bit like a side project to something else. Um, I like this story and I want to, I want to make something like this. This is the type of film I want to make. So I'm going to make it. It's just going to, it's a long journey. It's a process. I'm going to write it. Found out that I can take my case on the plane as well today. Very happy about that. So I can take all my stuff and, um, one less thing I have to worry about, really. <sighs> I might go out for a walk. I really fancy a walk. I could probably get this finished for, by today. I want to get it finished by today. And this is a film called Backpack Boy and the Apocalypse. It's going to be the longest film I make during the quarantine period. And it's going to take me quite a while, quite a few people to get this done. I'm going to try and do it in a week. Big challenge, but I want to, I want to do it. I want to do it. Um, it's later on in the evening and because um, it's my nan's birthday, we're going to go out for a meal. I finished the script, so the script is finished. It's got to print it off. I'm very happy with it. It's very different to what I've done before. Also, I got this. It's um, There's this really cool 
um, bar in uh, London. And they do some very cool drinks. I definitely recommend checking them out. Signature Brew. They make good stuff with some of my favourite bands as well. It's really cool. It's not sponsored by the way. I just uh, they're, they're a cool company. I'll come back and hopefully I can print off the script if I can find the printer. I know how do you lose a printer. Hello, good evening. You can't see me. Oh god, the eye size all the way up. That is not good. Okay, Google. Turn on Max's centre light. Oh, there we go. You can see much better now. There we go. That works. Uh, let's just test. Hello. Oh, that's much better. Hello. It's not the best lighting, but we're going to roll with it. We're going to roll with it. So yeah, that does it for today. I finished the script. It's going to be printed off tomorrow's vlog. And um, also, I'm getting on to the next stage of production with this little short film. It's looking like a fun one. It's going to be a cool one. Nothing really I can do tonight. <laughs> Uh, that one does it for me today. Thank you for joining me as always. I know it's been a bit of a weird day today. It's been a very weird day for me as well. Monday's is a very hard day. I, I feel like I'm just finishing off stuff from last week. Like I feel like I'm starting new stuff and everything's kind of early stages of production. Uh, you know what I mean? Monday's is, a Monday's is a hard day. Yeah, if you did enjoy, make sure you subscribe. Hit the like button if you want to. Um, stick around for some more videos. Comment what you want to see next. And that's all for me today. And goodbye. <laughs>